Okay, so welcome in. Um, that's the front door. And then we have our coat racks. We have a trash can here. It's full, don't mind that. We have games. And then you come in and then this is our space. It's super decorated nowadays. If you watched our old video, you probably saw that it wasn't this decorated, but we had some people over and we ended up putting up a bunch of stuff. So we have a bunch of like fun decorations in here. All the Polaroids in here are of us, just at like different events. So basically when you move into the dorm, you get this couch and you get this table and then you also get this table and then everything else we added. So my friend Emma, she brought like these bean bags and then Peyton brought this TV and then like everyone brought various things. This, my friend Iris gave to me for my birthday and we put it up. I brought the microwave and then this is like everyone's snacks. And then this is a camping chair that Iris brought that people sit in while their microwave stuff is going. And yeah, so this is the space. And then this is the balcony. Oh, it's locked, sorry. This is the balcony. We're on the eighth floor, so we're pretty high up. And sometimes people will like wave or yell at us from the other balconies. Um, and somebody left something out here, so rip. But anyways, then we have, this is our Minecraft poster. It goes with our creeper. And then we have our little minion buddy. And this, which Christina thinks is a poltergeist because we found it literally like outside McMahon just laying there. But I don't know, he's our friend Jimmy. And then we have like art that our whole cluster did at various times and newspapers from a Seattle artist, a local artist, and then some fairy lights. And then this is the hallway that has um, the other girls room. So each room has two girls in it. We're in a cluster of eight. Um, some of them are clusters of 10 with two singles, but this one's eight with four doubles. And those are all the other girls rooms. And then this is me and my roommate Mariella's room, 806. And so when you come in, my bed is right on the left. It's right here. Um, this is my bed and then you have this wall and then my closet and there's just there's going to be clothes and just decorations everywhere i'm getting ready to open up a store so i just have all my supplies just everywhere and then here's my closet over here our closets are actually huge they're like really big i don't know if you can tell but this is like six feet and like i don't know how deep it is but it's pretty deep a lot of the my cluster mates will actually like change in here because it's so big. I have a lot of clothes in here, so I don't do that. Um, but a lot of them do. And then it comes with this mirror. I attached these on top to hold and on bottom to hold earrings. And then I have like all my hair supplies and shoes and just everything. And then we also put this on there. Full length like, mirror is a must in your dorm. But yep. So this is my closet and then Mars closet and then her bed. This is her desk over here. And then it's an L shape. This is my desk. So then this is my shelf. This is her shelf. This is her drawer, my drawer, my d <laughs> messy desk. You can see all like the clothes under here because I'm opening the store soon. I just got those the other day. Um, and then these are our two like huge windows. They're so beautiful. You can open the bottom part. Hold on, move her strawberry plant. You can open the bottom part on both sides and let in like some fresh air. It's super nice also because it's tilted downwards. So even when it's raining, like it's no big deal to just open it. And it lets some fresh air in just because down here, this is actually, oh, you can't really see it, but there's a radiator down there. Um, and it does get kind of hot in here sometimes. So we like to open the windows in the night and then we have a fan. And then these are the desk lights that you're desk comes with it's like a little thing it turns on and then there's a plug here which i highly recommend using this outlet because the other outlets don't work as well as that one but it's this huge beautiful light and then <laughs> there's all our empty bottles from a party that we just had but anyways um then there's recycling trash um yeah this is our room this is completely raw so just by the way we didn't like clean or anything this is how it is obviously we didn't i didn't clean but i thought it would be pretty good to have like an accurate 
accurate video. And then I'll see if anyone is in the bathroom really quick, but that's the door that we came in. And then down the hallway, this is the second door that you can come in. So there's two doors in the main hallway that you can go into your cluster. That's the one that we came in. Then there's a closet. Then there's this door that you can come in if you wanna be like closer to the other clusters. And then this is the bathroom. It's not all that. There's just a cubby for each person and then supplies and then some hooks for towels and stuff. The toilet, two sinks. Ours, unfortunately, has a urinal instead of a second toilet, even though we're a female cluster, but that's fine. And then here's our shower. Um, we just share everything. So yeah, this is mine, my space. And then, just FYI though, there's no outlets in the bathroom. That's the one downside kind of of the bathrooms is like, there's no outlets in there. So all of your makeup, all of your hair stuff, or if you do any kind of like thing in the bathroom with um, electric, it has to be done in your room. That's why like my straighteners in here, my toothbrush has to charge in here because I'm an electric. But yeah, I hope that this was helpful. I hope this kind of showed the space. I feel like there's not a lot of accurate like videos of the whole space on YouTube. So I hope this helps. Um, just FYI, our dorm room that I'm showing right now is 180 square feet on the floor map of McMahon. I looked it up. So, yep, there you go. Oh, yeah. Also, if you end up wanting to check how big your room is, just Google UW McMahon floor plan and look up your room and figure out. It has it listed like for every single room. It has the square footage. So it'll help you kind of plan out how to decorate your room and stuff. But yeah, hope you guys enjoyed.